Rebellion of the Damned. Section. Conclusion. Quote, He who affirms the devil creates or makes the devil. Eliphaz Levi. Le Ritual de Haute Magie. The devil is a manifestation conjured from the depths of human consciousness. An archetype of rebellion. The embodiment of, quote, evil, as defined by the dominant status quo. The flame that lights the path of knowledge and self-empowerment through a world darkened by social and religious enslavement. The, quote, master of serfs, who, once evoked, has the ability to turn the world upside down. By the 18th century, progressive social changes were taking place across Europe, and the witch craze that afflicted France, and much of the continent, had more or less died down. The mass witch hunts ended with the Edict of Louis XIV in 1682, and the last French execution for heresy was in 1745. The forces of church and state had also largely reigned in, i.e. Christianized, the remote and rebellious rural areas, extinguishing the spirit of defiant social autonomy carried over from the Middle Ages and earlier times. Devil worship and black magic practices ceased to be rooted in the, the pagan folk traditions, heretical teachings, and popular superstitions of the countryside, and instead became the dark plaything of urban bourgeois circles. It will never be known to what extent accused witches and heretics actually participated in a culture of devil worship and ritual black magic during France's early modern period. But there is enough testimony, most coerced, some not, and physical evidence to suggest that at least some diabolical practices were taking place among the peasantry during this time. And why not? If a ruling, theocratic order that kept you in crushing servitude was under threat of being overthrown by, quote, a secret conspiratorial body organized and headed by Satan, wouldn't you join? End of article.